What's up, fam? It's your girl, Ike, here, and I just wanted to do a quick video on, because I, I know some things that I don't think you guys know, and um, I want to share it with you, because my, my level of outrage and frustration is 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 at an all-time high. I don't even want to fucking be in this country no more. You understand what I'm saying? I just want to fucking leave, but I need to share this with you. Y'all know I'm a lawyer, I'm a former prosecutor, and I'm currently a defense attorney. I was a prosecutor in Manhattan, New York City. So let me explain to you because we are getting a, a lot of feedback about these grand juries that are not indicting these police officers. And you need to understand something. The first thing you need to understand is that a grand jury presentation is an ex parte proceeding. What does that mean, Ike? Don't talk that lawyer shit. Okay, ex parte means one-sided. That means that there's only one side being presented in the grand jury. There is nothing to, to controvert or contradict what the prosecutor is putting in the grand jury. Unless a defendant chooses to exercise his right to testify in the grand jury. And even then, the defendant is allowed to come in with counsel. But you as an attorney, me as an attorney, when I escort clients into the grand jury... I am not even allowed to fucking speak. Do you hear me? I'm not allowed to say shit. If I want to confer with my client because he might not be sure how to answer a question, we got to step outside and come back in. The grand jury, the entire presentation is controlled, is orchestrated by the prosecutor. The evidence that goes in, the witnesses that go in, how the evidence is presented. The spin. Prosecutors control the grand jury. There's no judicial in, uh, oversight. Now, that's not till after you got an indictment. There's no judicial oversight about how the case is going to be presented, what witnesses are going to be presented, what charges are going to be presented. All of that is at the exclusive discretion of the prosecutor. Exclusive. If a prosecutor wants to get an indictment, bet your ass they will get it. They will get it because that's saying it doesn't take anything to indict a ham sandwich is fucking true. It doesn't take anything. And I'm a former prosecutor. Out five years, I indicted motherfuckers for five whole years. Okay? And I'm telling you, it don't take shit to do it. So the fact that Eric Garner, Tamir Rice, the most recent one, and all the others that have been down the line that have come back with what's called a no true bill, meaning that there is no indictment, meaning the case is over and the case is dismissed, that's orchestrated. Okay? Understand that shit. Know that that's orchestrated. Okay? Be pissed off. If you're going to be pissed off about something, the legislatures need to change the way grand jury presentations are conducted. They shouldn't be ex parte proceedings. It shouldn't be so that the defense has no, no, you, you have no representation. You have, there are some times where indictments are being presented or evidence in the grand jury and you don't even know. Okay. They have secret proceedings. Okay. And the whole, and the whole grand jury presentation is fucking secret, right? Secret. what that tell you? Anytime some shit is done in the secret, in the dark, it, the, 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 the chances for abuse. I mean, damn. It's like, how fucking dumb do they expect us to be? We can't, this, 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 I, I don't, listen, I don't want to fight no more. I'm sorry. I don't give a fuck. I'm done with this shit. You can't keep banging your head against a wall and expecting the wall to give. That shit is cement. These people hate us. They hate us. They are killing not just us. They're not killing just our men. They're not killing just our women. They are killing our children. I have a 12-year-old son. I live in Nassau County. We're allowed to have airsoft fucking guns. Airsoft pistols, BB guns. I won't let my son take one of those guns outside of our house. I have to sit him down and make sure he understands that your little white friend that you play with, he could play with the gun outside. You can't. You can't. This is fucking America. Fuck America. Fuck y'all because y'all been fucking us for hundreds of years. And Ike is fucking tired.